Hello and welcome to Script Tonight Reacts. I'm Script Tonight. Today we're going to be watching Season 4, Episode 6 of The Expanse. This episode is called Displacement. I have been looking forward to this episode ever since I finished last episode. I don't have anything else to say. Let's have it. I'm really hoping that we just pick up where we left off and everyone's going, ah. The whole damn island's just gone. Look at the radiation profile. It's like a reactor failure. For a gigantic reactor. Shit. You know, There's no more conversations about this. It's not <laughs> going the way I hoped. Jim. One of the islands on the other side of Illus just exploded. Like a thermonuclear <laughs> bomb. I think there might be some kind of massive... Okay, that's bad. Very bad. The first thing you're going to feel is the seismic quake from the explosion. Oh, it's shit. It's moving straight through the planet, so it'll reach you in, like, an hour. Well, we could deal with an earthquake. There's a shockwave coming around the planet at the speed of sound. With a tsunami behind it. Oh, shit! Fuck me. How long do we have? The shockwave will hit in eight to ten hours. With winds of around 200 kilometers per hour. The tsunami will be there roughly... 10 hours after that. Jesus. That's gonna put like a third of the continent underwater. The settlement is gonna get wiped clean off the map. I'll call you right back. Oh shit. Oh shit. God damn it, listen to me! Thank you. Cash got something important to say. We have an emergency. us yeah. mm. believe me i wish none of this had happened but the only thing we can do now is leave before more people die then will you support our claim mm. tell your friend the secretary general that we have the right to be here if you do that publicly and pledge to help our colony then we'll agree to leave damn right i can't speak for avasarala but i give you my word I'll do everything I can. Oh. Mercury did not like that. It's time for us to go. I just have a bad feeling they're gonna get fucked over. Oh yeah, Jacob. We're prepping the chateau mm. and we found something that belonged to you. Oh, you don't sir? What did I say? I knew it. What are you doing up there? Nothing. I just wanted to go to university. I need to tell you some things about what your mother has done. It won't be easy to hear. Shit, look at that! So oh my god! Put the blast at Jesus. 50,000 exajoules. This planet is going to look very different tomorrow. What about the other islands? Oh, shit. The other islands all appear to be cooling down, so small favors. When times <laughs> like these, I'm grateful for those. It's a much nicer view from orbit. I'll be up there soon enough. Oh, no, she's going to get the green eye. She's going to get the green eye. I did not forget about the green eye. I need to thank you. No, you did not. I would have died. Yeah. Probably. But you didn't. So, anyways, I just wanted to give you some good news. Your daughter's okay. I tracked her down. She's on the bar. <laughs> Girl, open up a channel to Felcia uh, Maisel, right? You guys want to be alone? Oh, be alone. Be alone. Oh, fuck. Felcia, are you on? Papa told me what you did. All those people who died on that shuttle. 
I never met anyone to get hurt. I'm not... All we uh, talk about keeping their family together on Illis. And you're the one that ran away. At least I didn't kill anyone first. Oh, shit. <laughs> What am I looking at? What are you doing? Hey, Naomi, what's going on? Reactor's down. Looks like a bad fuel pellet. A batch of them. Uh, I'm coming right up. A bad fuel pellet? Oh, no. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Looks like the barb and the Eddie are in the same boat. All their systems check out okay, but as soon as they try to fire up the reactor, zilch. Oh, shit. Great. So the physics of fusion have just stopped working. Looks like that protomolecule is back at it again. Fuck. People have been locked in dead quarters by corporate soldiers. They have been executed without trial. And now we are being ordered to evacuate. We won't stop anyone else from leaving. They can go in peace. But we will not be forced from our homes again. So if we take the OPA at their word, it means that we have all lost contact with everyone on that godforsaken planet. Oh, yes, fuck. Pulse. I'm very happy that we're back on Mars. I just got to say that because I really, really did miss Bobby last week and I'm keen to kind of see how she's getting on with Issei Martin, all that kind of thing. So we are well and truly in the shit now, basically. This thermonuclear device slash island has exploded. We've got the earthquakes are going to hit them because that will come through the Earth's core. And then they've got a deadly tsunami coming in at the speed of sound. All comms have been shut down and somehow the fusion, the, the, now the generators on the ships aren't working. Because apparently now the rules of fusion have changed. Shit. Play. Your items are there and waiting, as agreed. I'm going to check the inventory. If it's all the same to you, do what you gotta do. <laughs> hey, answer. Three, two, one. <laughs> You're breaking my wrist. Yes, that is the intent. <laughs> Unless you'd prefer to leave. I love her. You waiting for someone? No. <laughs> Why would I be? Hmm? Can't trust anyone anymore. Sad. Splits at the same spot. <laughs> Doc Foreman. Shit, did not turn out well for the dog man, did it? I'm gonna be ready to go. Worried about me? Only if I have to be. It would have been a shit ton easier if we had the heavy shuttle, but we'll make it. Wait a minute. Pause. But they're not gonna be able to leave the planet then, are they? If the, if the ships in the... in space... aren't able to... Are they gonna not be able to launch? I mean, they're gonna... Oh, shit. Play. Oh, here we go. The earthquake has arrived. Fuck's sake. That whole, uh, come down and sweep y'all up to safety plan that we had? That ain't gonna happen. Why not? Our reactor's out. 
All of the reactors are out on every ship in orbit. The fuel pellets are no longer fusing. Yeah, the old blue goo. Our guess is that when that island fusion reactor blew, some system on this planet decided to keep anything similar from happening again. Oh, what? You. What about Miller? He's gone. He helped us so we could bring him here. He may be done with us now. That seems a little bit ungrateful if you ask me. <laughs> the light shuttles and the Israel and the Barbie's chemical rockets, which means they'll still work. They're small, but we can send them up and down in rotation. Evacuate a dozen at a time. But one of them is a bomb. Getting you all off the ground is only half the problem. The Baba Piccola is too low. And it's not rated for atmosphere. First things first. Not rated for atmosphere. What does that mean? The Barb's thrusters were not designed for this kind of work, and... The drive is out. We can't speed up. So sooner or later, the Barb will fall and burn. Dorosi's batteries will last longer, but eventually... We all will. Fuck. Now! This is a serious problem. I don't intend to have any of the belters on my shuttle. They're welcome to use the heavy, if they can reassemble it. I'm done negotiating. You said that you'd endorse their claim. You made yourself a partisan in all this. Fuck off. I'm willing to help get them up safely and back down again, provided they dump all the illegally mined lithium on their ship. Oh, you are so shit. They're sh You're not saving them. You're just killing mm. them slower. Well, they can't stay on the surface. Greet the wave that you unleashed. <sighs> wow. Wow. That's amazing. Tree. Is there a problem with the shuttle? He's gone. Oh shit! What's going on with the moon? The science team is on it. They uh, think it might be melting. Nothing else. Need for the ship. The moon is melting. So what's Plan C? We'll go to the ruins. I was going to say that. There was no entrance. That man inside my head opened a door and then closed it again. We'll have to make our own way in. We have mining charges. We blast it open. Assuming that works, you still have to seal it behind us. We'll figure it out. We don't have a lot of time. We'll figure it out fast. Because the moon is melting. What the fuck is happening? We'll be sending an unmanned probe to New Terra. It's the fastest way to reestablish communication with our expedition. The OPA has no objection to that. We weren't asking for permission. Oh, fuck off. The Sojourner. Do you know who was behind the attack? Marco Inaros, a terrorist. He will be killed. He should have been already. Before our missiles destroyed the Sojourner, a surveillance satellite on Luna detected a high intensity laser from the vessel. That's a tight beam comm laser? That's what we think. Tight beam encryption module. Based on the direction, it would suggest the telemetry was being sent to the belt during the attack. To an unregistered OPA relay, perhaps? Perhaps. We will let you know what we find. By order of UNN Fleet Command, we will be remaining inside the ring space to help secure it from any further incidents that are beyond oh, your ability oh, to control. Oh, 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 we don't need a babysitter. Those are not the conditions of the armistice. The OPA violated those conditions first. Marco Norris is not under our control. Then why did you promise you could deal with him if you could not? Shit. Sticks. We'll be in touch. Fuck. Nice view. Oh, you... Bunch of bastards. Commander, they were measuring your office for curtains. Mm. Mm. 
Mm. It's an ancient inner saying. It means showing openly that they intend to take what belongs to you. Yeah, they absolutely did. I stand by my vote. We need to check the logs of every dark OPA relay that could have been targeted by the Sojourners tight people. I'll put a team on it. And if we don't resolve this quickly and to the UN's satisfaction, then they will never leave. And we won't be able to force them to go. Play. <laughs> <laughs> so it could well have been Bobby's action that enabled that mission to be completed because it was the tight beans that she was allowing the OPA people to take um, in that first mission with Issei Martin. So that's quite interesting. And I've just realised I've paused it back on a reveal that Bobby and Thomas are together, which I thought was going to be the case, but was not 100% sure. But this is going to be interesting to see how this plays out. Bobby's got a love interest. Play. <laughs> 